James Mullenis. I'm gonna talk about this waiter's corkscrew next. Stay tuned, it's called Corcus. Corcus here, and uh, you know, I just, um, you know, approached to review it. And I thought, oh, it's not gonna be any different than this here. And I have dozens of these. And this is a pretty standard model here, uh, much smaller than this here. And I looked side by side and I thought, oh, they're gonna perform very similarly. And it turns out that I think this one is just amazing. It's really cool. And uh, I'll tell you the reasons why. First of all, if you look at the side by side, just the way that this is shaped, it has a really nice curve to it and it seems to open up so comfortably. The niches are perfect so that you don't have to really dig in. Sometimes I've opened up a wine bottle thinking I probably you know, chipped the top of it because this is too sharp or it wasn't the right angle, but this seems to work really, really nicely. I've opened up several bottles of wine with this particular uh, Corcus waiter corkscrew and uh, I think it's fantastically well done. What I love about it, so this is pretty standard. It's, it's not that interesting because I have tons of them. This is more interesting and beautiful, luxuriant because of the uh, wood um, siding to this and just looks really durable uh, compared to this here. So I think it's just nice, nice, nice. But it's not just about nice, it's about good quality and ease of opening up a bottle of wine. It's so inexpensive, I'll put more information down below so you can seek them out. But uh, here we go, I'm gonna open up this. I put this towards the side because I'm not gonna review this bottle, I just wanna show what it looks like in terms of how it is to open up this bottle of wine. So it's, it's pretty easy, it, it's pretty seamless when you open up this bottle here. Um, just opening up the cap here and uh, I like that the the knife portion is pretty, I wouldn't say super sharp. So it's so easy to open up the cap here. To two seconds, it usually takes a little longer to do that. Close that for safety. And then opening this up is a really easy thing to do. And uh, so here we go. So I'm gonna just put this on its side here so you can see it's just a nice angle that this has. So you're gonna open up one and then just use a second uh, etching here, second ledge, and there you go. So this is seamless to uh, open up this bottle of wine, and uh, I love this. This is a 94 point wine opener, and uh, you know I don't see a lot of these that I love, but this I love. I'm always gonna leave this um, in a prime place in my um, wine table because I think it's fantastic. I believe in waiter's corkscrews than any other wine opener. I don't think you need an electric one. I think being too dependent on electrical devices to open up your wine bottles is not necessary, but I think it's a nice way to have something that's, you know, a historic wine opener. It's fantastic. But I think the um, added uh, benefit here is just a superb design, and I think it's fantastic. And uh, the knife on this, uh, the foil cutter is super nice. So I'm always really careful about these, but uh, I think it's a nice one just to open up the foil on your wine bottle. Again, 94 points out of 100 points. Thank you for watching. I love doing these videos where I'm doing something slightly different and I'm not always reviewing a bottle of wine, which there's nothing wrong with it, but I like to you know, step out of that comfort zone and try other things as well. Corcus, thank you for watching. You'll find me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, LinkedIn, and WordPress. So stay tuned for more reviews to come. Sante.